Uh, good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Everybody standing for the national anthem of Croatia. to be shaping up in a 4-4-2 formation. Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There is a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running and it enables risk-taking while the gaps are filled. I'm, I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works, it's still valid, and I think we're going to see it be successful here. the way so Jim who would you identify as the key man in this fixture yeah Luka Modric he's someone Peter who reads the game that little bit quicker than everyone else he's got fantastic technique too and that allows him to weigh his through balls to near perfection as well as keep hold of it when he's under pressure he's a real leader out there someone who can take control of the game and maintain it yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Vlasic. Oh, sweet feet. Kovacic. Modric. Cleared away. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. It's a loose ball. That's a... He's good for it! A real chance and a real let-off. Quick thinking and quick control, Peter. That creates a, a little more working space. Rebic, Vlasic, Rebic, good run down the left, what can they make of it? Just deflected over the goal line for a corner. Modric goes short, looking to go deep, and he just whacks it away to get it forward quickly breaks on here and it's Ilicic Josip Ilicic questions were asked and he's given the answers Vlasic good challenge he just stood firm Kurtic Hoists it forward, cut out in the nick of time. Kovacic. Vida. Forward it goes. And it's played forward. Modric.
and it's Ilicic. in the way of that. Yeah, I just thought he made great use of his upper body there. It would have taken something really special to keep that in. Slovenia take the early advantage. Slovenia have hit the front early, a foothold in the game. What a good start to the game. I think their play has been fast and inventive, and, and this is a fine example of early intent. They've begun as they mean to go on, and another goal is on the cards. Vlasic, and he's away, Vlasic, and here's Perisic. <laughs> Slovenia are enjoying this surprise lead. Tries to cross, knocks it away. That's a throw. Played into the middle. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Chance to cross here, and it's hoisted clear. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Rebic. Oh, good ball. Kortic can hoist it clear. Michalko. And here's Perisic. Gets the chance to cross. They didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box, and that speaks of little ambition. Rebic. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. And here's Ilicic. Vida attempts a clearance. And it's Kurtic. He'll hit it! Michelko. Oh, they've seen lots of the ball. Time to go for it a bit. A bit of creativity and adventure. Referee's given a throw. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Perisic. And the shot! And 
That's been won straight back. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's played forward. Michelko. And it's Perisic. Defending of the desperate variety. Finds himself eased off the ball. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Rebic. Modric. And that's clear cut, it's a free kick. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Kovacic. Hardly anything between the sides, and it's 1 0. Michelko. Vida. Michelko. Modric, Vlasic, just brushed off the ball there. Vlasic really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Rebic. Oh, great defending, that needed doing. Lovren. Kovacic. Slovenia are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. And here's Perisic. Kovacic hoists it forward, Kovacic goes back to base, Lovren, Kovacic, Rebic, balls out on the left now. Lovely bit of skill there. So who's he picking out? Puts in a crop. Has a goal! It's off target and by quite a way. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Modric. Perisic desperately wants to get on the end of this. Modric. Perisic. Lasic. He's got away. Forward it goes. Foot in. Lasic. Modric. Kovacic. It has got through to him. Hits one! A really 
close shave and the last action of the first half. And here we are, off they go for half time. The great they did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that important lead. Analysis to come during the break. Already up and running for the second half. Well, one nil may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Modric. Teresic. Plays it out to the flank. One way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. And it's for Selko. Vlasic. Kovacic. Vlasic. What an adventurous run from a defender. And that has been cleared. What a throw in. Vlasic gets up to head it! No, oh, not the best of headers. All he'd be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. He tries to get it forward quickly. Michelko, Teresic, Kovacic. Out towards the flank, back into the middle. He's on his way. He's not played the ball, that's a foul. Keeper sends it forward. Kurtic. Lovren positions himself well and cuts it out. Rakitic. Vlasic. Forward it goes. Going for goal! No attempt. Just the wrong outcome. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Perisic. Vlasic. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to to turn Teresic built just a single goal between the sides Modric and it's Teresic That is terrific skill. Vlasic. Rakitic. Perisic has got himself a free kick. 
Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. It's anyone's ball. Hoists it forward. Modric. Perisic. Jim, what are you thinking? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Croatia are definitely going about this the right way. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Just has to be done. Played towards the front men. Vida. Rakitic. Modric. And it's played forward. Gets it back. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Rakitic, Modric, Rebic, Vlasic, Vlasic! He's done very well to get to that. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Done very well to intervene. And it's Ilicic. Kurtic. And it's played forward. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Tries to switch the play. Perisic. Gets away from his opponent. Out to the right. That's the throw. to win it back. Hoists it forward. Modric. Perisic. Lasic. It's Rakitic. Rebic plays it out to the wing. Kurtic with the clearance. 75 minutes played. Got a shot away! Lasic. Rebic. Croatia simply cannot let their heads drop. They need their big characters now to keep them going. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise.
beautifully done. Rakitic. Rob. Now it's Rakitic. Trying to get there. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Oh, nice touch. And it's Rakitic. Whipped in. Tries to get it clear. Croatia are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Rakitic. Rob. Slovenia leading here by this still precarious 1-0 margin. Delivers a cross. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. He's found his man. He's left his man. And he's there to clear it. Caught in, in or out. Slovenia have themselves a chance from the spot. Well, they can protest all they want, but a shake of the head is all they're going to get. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Oh, and that should have been two. Josip Ilicic really did let them off the hook. They could have wrapped it all up. Forward it goes. Slovenia are on the verge of a pretty special win, but they've got some hanging on to do here. Averted for now. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Chance to break. Slovenia just have to run down the clock. They're making life really hard for themselves. The ball needs to be in the mixer, not there. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Good challenge, he just stood firm. It's being played forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Lovren. And the shot! And for a moment, time stood still. Well, the work rate to win the ball back was fantastic, and it set up the opportunity. That's great effort. Modric. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Slovenia hit it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. Your thoughts on today's game, then, Jim? Oh, Peter, I'm sure a more comfortable margin would have been preferable, but you can expect to get your way all the time. I think it was a win earned through game management, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. So thank you very much, Jim, for joining me. That brings us to the end of our coverage. So from us both, a very good evening.